Richard from Brazil made Alia three years ago. And what are you doing here today? I'm working with my youth movement. Uh, and today specifically, we are volunteering, helping to order the, the uh, clothes that people donated mm -hmm. to, to give the people that need to receive it. laying tile for the stage so we're doing the reno on the stage right now he is has a laser thing out here we're trying to level it out getting it nice and uh, even he's now lifting it up so we have enough place for the uh, filler so we need filler and then on that's going to be the tile It's another green leaf, very, very healthy for you. It's getting there. And what it'll do is it'll grow like this, layer after layer after layer. After. And so what we're gonna do is take it off right here. And then it's not for you. Mm. Oh wow. There's nothing like fresh vegetables in a garden that just sets the day mm. hey good morning this is Stephen the uh, Galilean gardener here 
And we are here in the Aliyah Return Center Gardens where we're gonna be harvesting today to donate to a food bank down in Tiberias. So again, we, ha we, we have is our yu choy sum, we have our bok choy, and some more, um, all these vegetables that will go through that wonderful bok choy there. And just to uh, see kind of how it's harvesting, you can see the, um, what we do is we'll take, the, this is a bit uh, overgrown, but it's fine. It, you want to get it when it's flowering like this and it will cut the, the bottom. And basically this is the whole plant itself right here. Nice big leaves. This is what's, what's the, the good stuff is right here in the stock. And the stock is going to be what you can stir fry, you can put in salads. The leaves are also very delicious. And this is a, just a perfect time um, to get it. That nice. All right, so now we have finished what we've harvested today, and now we're off to Tiberius to town to give it to the food bank, the people that can really use it and give it to people that need it. Guess what we also got today? We were donated these nice, delicious grapefruits from Migdal, wonderful place in Migdal. And we are paying it forward right now, and we're gonna go deliver it as well with all the vegetables. Look at these. All right, next time. Thank you guys for all your support. Thank you for helping us to help them. We're just paying it forward. Praise the Lord. So it's not even us, it's God doing it. Yes! It's empty. <laughs> Okay, um, the plan is to make this into a place for people to stay. And so, at the moment, we're building, uh, we're gonna build a platform that comes out here, and the tree will be in the middle of the platform with a view of the view valley.
Happy New Year, 2020 vision, kingdom vision. Boy, am I amazed at what is what God is doing right here in the promised land. You know, you've heard about the work we do with the Alia. You've heard about the work that we do with orphans and widows. You've heard about with the agricultural school and, and so on and so forth and the clothing distribution. But what I'm just the most excited about right now is that what I call the heartbeat of it. The very heart is prayer and worship. You know, this, this valley, Ezekiel spoke of a valley with dry bones. Is it the Jordan Valley with the Jordan River in the middle right down there? You know, I don't know, but I can tell you these bones are no longer dry. They're coming together. They're standing together. And, and you know what? God is putting his spirit in them. Do you want to make a difference? Be part of a movement of Jews and Christians working together for Israel. In the past seven years, the Aliyah Return Center has worked to help new immigrants take their first steps in Israel. Together, we've renovated a historic boarding school on Kibbutz Beit Zera, located just five minutes from the Sea of Galilee along the Jordan River. We've been able to transform a broken down community into a home where new immigrants from all over the world can return and be looked after and provided for by Christians. Together, we offer shelter for lone soldiers who have no place to call home in Israel. Together, we're able to help widows and put a roof over their head, add warm meals, supportive fellowship, and together, we're able to bless Holocaust survivors, Arabic-speaking people, Hebrew-speaking people, people from the nations, and all come together into a community. Together, we continue this work today, changing the face of Israel, and all this is possible with your support. Join us at aliyahreturncenter.com. Stay, learn, and serve. Bless God's people. Hi, I'm Dean and this is Chaim. Will you support the return of the Jewish people in good times and in bad? We're asking for your help today and out of a love for God, will you bless Israel? This river symbolizes a choice to be made, either to fear or to move forward in power with the plans and purposes God has for you as heroes of faith. Go to aliyahreturncenter.com right now to play your part in the prophetic work. We thank you for working together for Israel.